Adobe has just released a massive update for Lightroom Classic, and I want to walk you through all the new features included with version 12. Let's jump in. Let's first talk about the new feature included with the healing panel. You'll now see three icons appear, the second two being the trusty healing and clone brushes, but the first is something special. This eraser tool isn't just any old eraser, more specifically it's a content aware eraser. If you're familiar with Photoshop then you probably recognize that term. Content aware gives us the ability to erase and fill in unwanted objects in your image using AI. Now instead of needing to clone a similar area of the image, the AI auto-generates the necessary color and texture, giving you 100% unique results. Simply select the general area of the unwanted object and Lightroom does the rest. The masking panel has also once again been updated. This includes a new background select tool, which is a great quality of life feature, now saving us the trouble of needing to invert your subject mask. Also included is their new object selection tool. Simply select the general area of the desired object with either the square brush selector, you definitely don't need to be exact about this, and the AI will automatically detect it. Very, very cool. But probably the biggest update, especially for us portrait photographers, is the new AI subject selection features. Not only do you now have the ability to select a specific person in your scene with these nice little avatars right here, but once you do, you now have the ability to mask specific elements of that person's face and body. Skin, eyes, lips, and hair. With just one click. Heck yes. These new features for me personally are a huge time saver, and I know will be for you as well, so go ahead and go update to version 12 as soon as possible to take advantage. And you can be sure to find these new features in upcoming Archipelago sets, so keep an eye out for that as well. As always, I hope this video was helpful and informative. If you did enjoy it, please hit that like and consider subscribing if you haven't already. This is Chris, signing off, and I'll see you in the next one.